Hi, I'm Jay French at jfrenchstudios.com, and I'm going to show you how to draw Naruto characters. Okay, in drawing Naruto characters, the two main other characters are Sasuke and Sakura, and we're going to do the boy. Now he's got similar features to uh, Naruto, but his chin's a little point here. And get this headband in there. And it, of course, has the same symbol. You can do dots or little curves for rivets, if you like. His hair, it's a whole different style. We're going to do him at something of an angle. You will sometimes see a bridge of a nose on him if he's angled enough, which we only have a slight angle, so we'll just put a little bit of a line there. His eyes, generally, unless he's surprised, are much thinner. And in fact, you may not even do a, an ink line for the under part of the eye, just a division between the flesh tone and the white of the eye. He also has a very low eyebrow ridge. And we have the hair, a very sharp angle up here. And then this tendrils that hang down on the sides of the face, like that. This is all hair here, so this is all dark. And he has the hair that sticks out the back. Because he is a kid, and kid's hair does that. You will often see the back of his headband and where it's tied. But then, he has his weird little turtleneck thing. Oh, I forgot to finish his mouth. He tends to be much more grim of expression than Naruto himself. He will be able to see his ear, however. Do the rest of this in shading, and the shading from his hair can just go straight to the shading under his face. You can put some highlights in here. They're going to be a little more angular than your standard wavy highlights on anime, because his hair is all straight but it's very spiky and wild, so you don't want to show it as smooth. It's very choppy. So you get the big turtleneck. Get some wrinkles under there to show where it collects. And then you get the rest of his costume. And that's how you draw one of the Naruto characters.